Welcome back everyone to Moons and Pearls. I'm here to do a spiritual update for Pisces. Pisces, how are you guys doing? If you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Luna and I would be more than happy to have you guys. Um, let's see what's in your current energy for you guys, Sagittarius. What's going on in the current energy for Sagittarius? Let's watch the Luna here trying to oh. Okay, a reminder to cleanse your energy, your space, um, your energetic surroundings need to be cleansed. So whether it's um, cleansing your, your aura with the people that you've been hanging out with or where you're spending your time, um, there's a little bit of shying away from praise and um, leadership opportunities as well, a little bit of a challenge, believe in yourself, Sagittarius. Um, and I'm curious to know about this card about authenticity. Like sometimes, whether it's your style, how you dress or something, um, I don't know why I feel like some of you are either self-conscious or doubting your creativity um, because you're different, but you're different for a reason because um, you're amazing at what you do and what you create. So um, bending to peer pressure, obligations, hiding, um, living someone else's life. But I do feel like the energy is more about hiding um, a little bit here and maybe with obligations for you guys. So let's get into your challenge. Let's get into the tarot. Um, how have you guys been? Um, make sure you like, share, subscribe. We'd be more than happy to have you guys. Um, let's see what's been the challenge for Sag. What's been challenging Sagittarius? It's important to ground, ground yourself. I feel like for a lot of you, a lot of people tell you that you're cold, that you have confusing energy, that sometimes you're very honest and clear, and then sometimes you seem to be hiding, whether it's your emotions, like you don't really, sometimes you express yourself and sometimes you don't. So, um, tell me more about the challenge. I also want to say, because uh, I'm reading this in a different way too. There's three kings here, so I feel like there are either um, multiple people involved around you, Sagittarius, um, male or female, and someone needs to make a decision between which king to talk to or somebody's been talking to a lot of people, or there's someone that um, has very unstable energy, okay? Um, there's someone that is anxious uh social anxiety i'm hearing um not sleeping well uh tell me more about this lots of swords so i feel like what someone has a lot of like interest in what people say um like there's a fear of rejection there's also like I don't want to say feeling weak, or, but feeling vulnerable um, to people's criticisms, I'm hearing. Um, so that's been a whole challenge for Sagittarius, not you. It could be someone else that's around you, but that's kind of what I'm hearing or reading from you in your challenge, okay? Um, let's see what, one more for the challenge for Sagittarius. Not moving blocking so not really talking i feel like not really talking about emotions or future plans and i feel like somebody wants you to make a move like hurry up why what's taking you so long but i feel like something was said that made you feel some sort of way sagittarius um so you're just i feel like trying to figure that out right now so that's been that's a big challenge for you guys let's see what's in the current energy Big changes, moving out, um, or I don't want to say being kicked out of a place, but like um, I feel like you feel like you're not wanted somewhere, but lots of changes um, in places of movement. Uh, faulty foundation, maybe you were living together with someone and just not as strong as you thought it would be. Um, and also in terms of work related, um, it's not, it's not strong so there's definitely a lot of sadness disappointment i cannot believe i went through this again i'm hearing um like another failure there's memories here yep there's definitely a breakup separation there's memories either with this person or someone else 
tell me more about this current energy for Sagittarius. What's this? Okay, so um, somebody wants a new beginning or restart or reset, um, but they're not sure because they view, whether it's this recent person they broke up with or someone else from their past, um, they feel like this person doesn't care for them or about them anymore, like completely heartless or emotionless, cold, a lot of coldness from the other partner. So um, I feel like there's a lot to figure out, but there's also a lot of different emotions pulling or tugging on you right now, Sagittarius. One more for current energy. Yeah, not, not able to make a decision in your head about do I, do I give this? Commitment, another opportunity, or do I just move on? Yeah, trying to manifest, praying, trying to make something happen, but because there's so much confusion, nothing is happening, okay? So let's see what's coming towards you in the near future, near future energy. You're going to end up <clears throat> speaking to someone, and you're going to, I feel like um, you want to be able to be seen as a caretaker, uh, somebody, someone who has their finances, finances together, <coughs> and I feel like you're gonna let go of this fear. Um, it's gonna take a little bit of time to regain courage. Um, time to, I feel like someone's not out in the sun, like unable to. Someone's not happy being away from someone, is what I hear. Um, what's the advice for Sagittarius for this? Patience, wait, because um, God is orchestrating um, a way to make things happen in the perfect time. Okay, so patience, pray, everything's going to work out. Uh, let's see, what do we have here from this deck? For Sagittarius, we have the horse. Find the balance between instinctive and tame part of your personality. Okay, so again, um, here we go with that uh, balance of coldness, hotness, instinctive, um, like what else did it say? Tame, um, just trying to figure it out, okay? Um, let's do our self-care cards for Sagittarius. If you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Help keep our channel growing. Change course. A closed door is an invitation from life to move in an even better direction. It's time to change course. Look at that, you guys. Shine. Don't dim your light. The world needs your unique talents and gifts. Shine brightly. We talked about, it, about that at the beginning of the reading, you guys. You are different for a reason. Um, so keep shining and action. Baby steps are still steps. They're better than standing still. So you know which way, you'll know. I feel like, pray about it, you'll know which way you need to move. Um, and just continue to always take steps towards your, your best well-being. Um, see what's going on from our angels, okay. It's up to you, make up your mind, recovery, so healing, and success. Um, let's see, it's up to you. The end result of the situation you asked about is entirely in your hands. You can affect the outcome by taking a proactive approach, taking action to solving any challenges. Stand in your own power and have confidence that you have what it takes to bring about a happy ending. Don't wait for someone else to rush in and take charge. In order to come to a successful conclusion, this situation requires your unique perspective and experience. All right, Sagittarius, there's not much I could say because there's a lot of, a lot of confirmation in your reading. Um, make sure you like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you soon. Ciao.